Kiss Kazoo Animal Farm. It's a roadside zoo, a private zoo in Three Hills, Alberta, run by the Gustafson family, primarily Lynn Gustafson, his son Bill, and his wife uh, Irene Gustafson. It used to be a dairy farm and a fur farm, but they've got a zoo license and have added on hundreds of exotic and other domestic animals, which they are completely unequipped to care for. Yeah. Yeah, not only does this uh, province really not provide the correct environment for a lot of the species that he carries, he just hasn't made any effort to uh, to accommodate their behavioral needs or, or physical needs or well-being or anything like that. So all, all of these animals are, most of them are severely psychologically damaged. Um, they're bored, um, they exhibit stereotypic behavior, a lot of them are sick, a lot of them are improperly euthanized, uh, essentially. Um, no, notable deficiencies in all aspects of operation is yeah. what uh, the, was, was what Kaza stated. They said they uh, failed every aspect of the operation. This is an inspection that was done in 2011. And that includes public safety as well. The facility is extremely unsafe for the public and uh, as far as zoonotic diseases go and just being around all those exotic animals that are being kept in dilapidated enclosures like lions, tigers, dangerous primates. It's an accident waiting to happen. And it accidents have happened, but yeah, people have definitely been bitten there before. Lost um, fingers. Yeah. To see dogs. <laughs> and there is so much documentation of violations. Like there is a laundry list. It's it's unreal. Thousands of photos and video footage from years and years. I've been attending the facility for since two thousand and three or two actually. And have every year since then gotten more pictures multiple times and it's just it's they've painted over some things and they've made some aesthetic changes but the animals are still in the same dire circumstances they were when they started this. So and they you, always will be it's unrealistic for them to come up to it's, it's just not feasible. So you guys are here today for why? We are protesting in front of the um, ESRD building because the um, Environment and Sustainable Resource Development Department actually issues a Gazoo Zoo permit. So we're trying to prompt them to not do that this year. As well as enforce the standards that they've um, implemented but never actually implemented. Yeah. <laughs> enforce the legislation basically that they've, that's already present, they've just never made an attempt to enact it and by enforcing the standards he would not get the permit. Close. Yeah, he yeah. would be decommissioned.